What is up guys, this is Zishan with MZ and today we're going to be talking about the Surface Laptop Go. That's Microsoft's latest laptop. So let's begin. Surface Laptop Go features Microsoft premium build quality and design, but its lighter internals allow it to keep a lower price tag while still performing basic functions really well. The Surface Laptop Go starts at $550 in that you get a 12.4 inch touch screen with a 1536 by 1024 HD resolution. You also get a 720p HD webcam for your webcam calls. The Surface Laptop Go has a 10th generation Intel i5 processor, 4 GB RAM and 64 GB of EMM storage. This seems a bit low to me and honestly it's a bit disappointing because most phones nowadays have better specs than this. So I recommend getting the upgraded 8 GB RAM and 128 GB SSD storage. Spending the extra $150 today will save you a lot of headache later. Unlike the iPad Air, the Surface Laptop Go has a full-sized keyboard. It also has Microsoft's Precision Trackpad. You also get a fingerprint sensor on the keyboard. There's a USB-C and a USB-A slot on the side. Plus, you get a completely separate power charging slot as well. You can connect the fast charger to the charging slot and Microsoft says that you can charge up to 80% within one hour. And this 80% should take you throughout the day. The main function of this laptop is light usage, emails, light Microsoft Office usage, and maybe watch videos on Netflix. It's not supposed to be a powerhouse. The laptop's main competitors are the iPad Air and Chromebooks. That is why Microsoft made this compact and lighter than any of the competition. The Surface Laptop Go also comes in three beautiful colors. All right, guys, that was my review for the Surface Laptop Go. Let me know in the comments down below what you thought about the laptop. And if you enjoyed the video, please give it a big thumbs up. If you really enjoyed the video, go ahead and subscribe so you don't miss any of my future content. This was Zishan with MZA.